Welcome to Golden Software's Tech Tip video. This week's topic focuses on geo-referencing an image in Digger 5. This feature is used to reference an image to export as a spatially referenced file, or to digitize points or lines on the image and have them in a referenced XY location. To reference an image in Digger, at least three known points must be known in the image. However, these points do not need to be the corner points of the image. To import an unreferenced image, click File, Import. In the Import dialog, select the image file and click Open. The Image Registration and Warping dialog will appear for unreferenced images. In the Image Registration and Warping dialog, specify the location of at least three known points in the image. If you have the points saved in a DAT file, you can click the Load button to load the data points. You can click the Save button to save the points for later use or if you need to import the image again. You can also pick the points directly on the image. To locate the first point, click the digitize icon on the left. Then click the location of the first point on the image. In the worksheet below, click on point 1. The image X and Y values correspond to the pixel dimension of the image, so we are going to leave that alone. For the reference X and Y value, we are going to enter the real-world XY values. To enter the second reference point, highlight point 2 in the worksheet, click the digitize icon, and select the point on the map. Now enter the real-world coordinates in for the reference X and Y values. In the worksheet, select the third point, digitize, and enter the reference values. Since Digger only requires a minimum of three points, I'm going to delete the fourth point. This is done by selecting the point and clicking the Delete Point button. If you wanted to enter in a coordinate system, this is done in the Specify Coordinate System section. For this image, I am going to use Current and leave it in the Cartesian coordinates. When finished, click the OK button. The image is then loaded into Digger Georeferenced. You can then export the image or digitize the points and lines. This concludes this week's Tech Tip video. As always, if you have any questions, please contact Golden Software.